chat fam. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Thank you so, so much for joining us today. All of you are chat winning. Do you like that? I like it. <laughs> I need to bring my wife into frame. Hello. Oh, hey. <laughs> Guys, before I forget, in the last vlog, I was trying to show you guys Kara's push present, the moose head that she wanted. That's gonna go right here. So replacing our mirror. She's always loved animal skulls and the kind of like boho look. And so I found the absolute coolest moose skull and I got it for her and I actually surprised her with it. And I did film it on my iPhone. Um, this is about two months ago, maybe a little over two months ago. I'll just roll some of the clips now. This time I'm not gonna forget to put it in now. And so, the fact that we found this and that we gotta keep it just makes it like a once in a lifetime find. Like these, oh, these elk real. antlers. Look at this rare find. A fully intact, insanely large moose head. <laughs> My wife has wanted one of these things forever. So we're gonna go surprise her with it right now and see what she thinks. Do you think that look good on the wall? Oh yeah. It barely even fits in the trunk. And this trunk is huge. She's gonna love it. She's gonna love it. Kara, come here for a second. I have to show you something. Come here real quick. <laughs> Do you like it? Because, because you happy um, triplet push present day. Thank you, I love you, and I love this moose. So I think that skull is gonna fit perfectly up there. When it's all mounted and put up, we will show you guys what it looks like. I actually think it's gonna fit up there perfectly and it's gonna look really good. We'll show you guys. Triplet baby hawk coming in hot. So we've had a ton of requests for a triplet haul, which we just pulled everything out of the office where we've been storing it. There's a lot of stuff. We did not realize that we had so many like, little outfits. The whole living room is full of stuff. <laughs> it's a lot of clothes, but if you've had a newborn, you know bodily fluids are coming out like crazy from newborns, so you go through a lot of clothes. And I ran into these things like, what? Whoa, what are these? So we're gonna show you guys our favorite car seat ever. Merry Christmas 2018 triplets. We're ready for you. Come into the world already. Let's go. Eat up. Come on. Hot dang. What is all this <laughs> stuff? Oh my gosh. What is happening? I don't know. <laughs> oh, so this is my Sunday relaxed attire. Got a t shirt, some sweats, Ugg boots. These. All winter long, these babies are not leaving my feet. I'm so cozy right now. <laughs> I could just like sit by the fire and take a nap for a couple hours or 10 hours. Looking good. Thanks. Now let's, let's show this triplet baby haul already. People are waiting. Okay, let's go. Okay, so to start, I guess I'll just go over everything and where it's from. So any of you baby mamas out there that want to pick it up, know where to find it. I'll tell you what I like about everything. I got these for my baby shower. H&M, which if you didn't know, they do have baby clothes. They're really cute and they're pretty affordable. Like look bit. at these little like drop crotch boy pants. Are you kidding? I would sport those. They're so cute. Tiny, tiny girl sweaters. These, somebody Eric's family knows, made the matching little winter suit. Dude, ooh, those are soft. Oh, dude, this is Derek approved and Gemma approved. Gemma loves yeah, this Gemma stuff. Gemma loves. Mm. A huge haul of loved baby. It's organic baby clothing. All of this is loved baby. They have like the prettiest, just neutral colors. And then they also have this paint collection. They come up with different collections multiple times a year. We actually have their Christmas collection on its way to our house right now. So excited. Paint splattered, huh? There's a bunch of painters. This, this swaddle right here is also part of the Paint the Town collection from Love Baby. So pretty. So cute. Lulu and Rue. And then these ones are golden strands with newborns, the knotted gowns are so nice when you're changing diapers in the middle of the night. You just untie it. You untie it, their legs are out, tie it back up. Pia, come say hi. Oh, for those that were asking on the last vlog too, we forgot to answer. Pia weighs 
three pounds and she's five years old. So she is fully grown. Her we named her Penelope. Then we started calling her Pia. So now we call her Pia Penelope. So really her real name is Penelope. Another thing that we love about York is that they live forever. They can live until they're 19 years old. Pretty much all of our kids are gonna experience Pia. Hi, I love you. And she never stops looking. I love you so much. It's like having a little guinea pig. Favorite baby brands for pajamas. Kiki pants. We love kiki, kiki pants. pants. They're like that bamboo, stretchy, super soft material. And they're thin, where the Love Baby ones are nice because they are a little bit thicker. But these ones are just so snuggly and soft and thin. And then this is Milk Barn, but it has it's the same like fabric and same feel. Milk, Milk Barn. Barn. Kiki pants. Soft, soft. We got these for the boy, which is so fun because we've never bought boy clothes before. These are from Riley and Crew. Like how cute is that? Little deers. Riley and Crew has really good cute stuff. I don't know much about baby clothes, but I know Riley and Crew is good. That's what it is because it's a little expensive. This is probably the most expensive brand here. Everyone asking for Gemma's clothing too. She wears a lot of Riley and Crew, like her little long sleeve ones with the bloomers that are matching sets are all Riley and Crew. And they are expensive, but I usually buy her like two or three sets like per season and she wears them on repeat <laughs> over and over every day. People are asking Kara, did you have the babies yet? Let's check. No, that's a hard no for me. <laughs> it's gonna be it's no. a really hard no for me. I couldn't sleep last night until 4 a.m. They are coming so soon, so soon that don't blink or you're gonna miss it. <laughs> That's how soon. Another favorite place, two places of mine to shop for Gemma and the babies are Gap and Old Navy. And you can always find stuff for 40% off. Like there's always coupons, they always have sales going on. So I got these for the babies. And Gemma also got these matching dresses to these. So I guess they will be a little matching. And I have one from when Gemma was a baby still, so all three of them will be matching in those. So cute. Maybe baby. What is it? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe baby. baby. But they are so soft. They're like the kicky pants feel. Like so soft. Yeah, I could just like roll around in all of this and stuff. They all little Miss Dessa. Love Ooh, the knot. The knotted Love the knot. <laughs> and they're really soft too. They're like little mermaids. Yeah, they're the best. My special request, I'm gonna introduce this line. <laughs> Maybe because I love favorite. them. <laughs> Feed me. So cute. Hear me roar. Baby bird. That's a different brand though. Oh. Back to the brands. These are Minnie and Meep. Minnie Mini and Meep. And a lot. This one is the bee and the fox. Baby bird. So you can find them on Instagram or Etsy usually. Do you think that would fit me, Rod? Yeah, it looks really good. Let me try it on real quick. Probably real fast, hold on. And I also want to show you guys these things because I freaking love them. They're like little hedgehogs. They're extremely soft. The only problem is if you throw one, you're gonna have a little Yorkie that's just gonna go crazy. Not for you, these are not for you. These are not for you. Don't tease her. These are for the trips. These cute little hedgehogs are from Slumberkins. They are the coolest brand. It was started by two teachers and they're all about intention behind their little animals. So each one comes with its own story and they help to build confidence. They help with like upcoming change that could be happening and you can find one to fit like any situation, which is so fun for kids. Hey, that is not yours, girlfriend. That's not yours either. Literally, Pia has a hundred toys in here. Here, Chewy Vuitton. Look at Chewy. This from Binksy Baby. We never had one with Gemma, but seems pretty cool. It's like a little hammock for grocery shopping. So you're not putting like the car seat in, car, and you have all the room underneath. So I'm excited to try that. Dude, where has that thing been? You can even double up. We might need triple up but the ollie swaddle which i'm really excited to use but it's just like a little swaddle for them to sleep in oh the giraffe a classic which Gemma's, i'm pretty sure oh no that's not it is in pia's toy basket now yeah. she gave it to pia but we got a new sophie giraffe for teething every baby loves sophie three little mimis as Gemma calls them three little mamie baby 
My friend gave them to me for my shower. Love these dolls. Like handmade, these little knit babies, cuddle and kind. And for every doll purchase, they donate 10 meals to people in need. So that's really cool. And this is the bigger size and then you can also Dude, get... The unicorn's my favorite. <laughs> the unicorn is so cute. You can also get a little bit of a smaller size too, but one doll equals 10 meals. So They're so cute. let's do some math. One, two, three, four, that's 40. Yeah, 40 people got a meal for this. That's actually awesome. What does it feel like to have four babies? Oh yeah, hold on guys. Oh, do you guys wanna go to the gym? Oh, you wanna play some Xbox? Oh, do you wanna go to the movies? Oh, I can't. My hands are full, oh. but my heart is even more full. Oh, my little family. Oh. We love Baby Breeze. Baby Breeze. They are stretchy, soft. Gemma can wear them for so long because yeah. of how stretchy they are. They like this. they fit her forever. On to accessories. We got these little crowns. For when the babies come, they are so cute. That's legit. It's like a little love crush crowns. Ooh, pretty. Yeah, you're a princess. They come in really pretty, like neutral colors, not just like bright baby colors. All of these bows. I love bows. Gemma has a lot of bows. Bows, bows, bows. Bows are fun to buy. Bows, 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 bows. A world of bows. One of my very, very favorite bow companies is LaBelle Baby. She finds vintage velvets from all over the world and makes these gorgeous bows. Gemma has a million of them. So we got a bunch from her. And then these are so cute little Christmas time bows. And we're gonna get Gemma some matching ones too. Maisie Baby, Little Miss Dessa, Billy Bibbs, Chico Rose has these really pretty velvets too. Baby shoes from Sweet and Swag. Those are legit. They're so I tiny. I love them. Sweet and Swagalicious. They're so cute. We have three of those. Oh, Gemma has a pair of these from when she was a baby, so we have had to buy another pair, obviously, and we got hey, Gemma. You stop. A matching pair too, so all the girls will have matching little church shoes. How cute is this? Little nursling. We have two little nursling ones and two little darling ones. And these are from Milo's Corner. It's an Instagram shop. Briar handmade tiny little bonnets. Can't wait to put those on the babies. I don't know how to pronounce if it's silly or silly. Silly. S I I L I. Yeah. And they made these cute little bonnets with a brim. And these bows are actually by them too. So there you go with it too. And these bad boys from Cash & Co are so awesome. These are from my little boy. Little dinosaurs. Hi, how are you bud? We have these cute little beanies. They're from the Blueberry Hill. Gemma has a matching one with this too, but she's been wearing hers. And these are little turbans, oh. little baby turbans. They're so small and cute. Gemma wore these all the time, so I know these babies will be putting these to good use. Turby, turby, turby. Cute color. These ones are all from Top Knots Co. Top Knots Co. Little Knots. These, I am so excited to put on my baby's heads. Mercy Threads. Mercy Threads. She has a small little shop. You can find her on Instagram. Handmade. So cute. They're seriously perfection. <laughs> yeah, I just rest them all right, right <laughs> on that landing. Look at this. The little pom-pom. I can't. Like, these make me so excited to just put on their heads. We have all of these little baby swaddles. So these ones and these, they're amazing. They're linen. So these are their swaddles. Um, and then they have these linen swaddles as well. They're all hand dyed. They're made in... Oh. Oh no. Something just happened. No, do not. Is, now is not the time, girl. <laughs> that really hurts. We have a scheduled date. It is not right now. <laughs> My mom's not here yet. I can't. Okay. About, please don't have the babies right now. Huh. Are you good? So, are the babies staying in? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Please. 
They are made in Australia, hand dyed in Australia. They're all ethically made. They're beautiful. Like the colors in person are just gorgeous. And these also are for a good cause, which you know we like. So for every blanket sold, they donate a clean birthing kit to women in Haiti. Our really soft, stretchy swaddles from Mebe Baby. I think I'm pronouncing that right. We love Copper Pearl. We got these cute swaddles. And I love how a lot of things right now are gender neutral and they're still just so cute for either gender. Like any of this you can use basically besides the florals. Riley and crew swaddles. I then, recognize that thing. Yeah, Gemma. Gemma has, has an outfit that has that exact bird. That same fabric in one of her little top and bloomer outfits. You can have white with yellow or yellow with white. I just found this company. It's Wesley May on Instagram. These speak to my soul. I'm not kidding. Like this is me. I love this fabric. I just think it's so pretty. And it's so like not babyish, but still cute for a baby. Just stylish. And we have these three. Got these in a three pack. You can also buy them separately, but they're from Little Unicorn. And they have the matching bibs. Buffalo soldier in the heart of America. Dockatot is literally the best thing ever. When Gemma was born, we put this thing right in between our bed, right in between both of us. And she goes to sleep. And then we go traveling. We take this thing on the plane. We've taken it to the beach. It's really nice because we used it so much and to them, like that is their bed. So when you're traveling, if you're on the plane, if you're in the airport, if you're at a hotel, you're staying with people, they don't know the difference. They just love it and they go right to sleep just like they would at home. And then this thing on buckles, yeah. it's nice because you know, babies throw up a lot. So they're gonna throw up a ton on this thing. <laughs> but you just do one of these, quickly throw this thing in the washer, wash it, zip it back on. These are the Nuna Pippa. And we had this same car seat with Gemma. Loved it so much, got three more. Nice because it's light, has this little hood that you can unzip. And there's a magnet right there. But that's a sun visor, keeps it out of their face. It's so nice just to like put it back up in here. Lift up right here. And that's it, you got your car seat. So when you have to put the babies in the car, all you do, Literally one handed. That's the wrong way. You just took oh. it. Oh, there you go, baby A. Snap it. Let's go do B and C. And then I have had people ask if you can use this car seat without the base because I guess some car seats you can only use with the base. And yeah, this one you can the seat belt through and wrap it around the back and you can use it without the base. But this is the only problem that I have right now with the new one. <laughs> Parenthood just got three times easier. Yeah, I beg to differ. It just got three times way more difficult, Nuna. Sarah Noni is one of my, well, it's Gemma's favorite brand in the entire world. Sarah Noni, all of her little blankies are this brand, Sarah Noni. She has like the mini ones just to snuggle in the car and then she has the receiving size that she, it's like her baby blanket. She loves them. They are the softest things you've ever felt. This one's mine. I even have one. Yeah, we actually just always walk around the house <laughs> looking like that. It. It's the best. We even have them in a king size for our bed. But we got a bunch for the triplets too. Mmm, serenoni. <laughs> Last but not least. Wow. Okay. Let's talk bump. You guys might want to say goodbye to this baby. Let's all take a moment of silence. <laughs> Any memories you've had with this bump? Anything you want to like leave on the table? Any last words? Any words of advice? Any final departures of the bump? <laughs> Just make sure you leave them right here. We're going to do a moment of silence real quick for the bump. Pia, yeah, I said moment of silence. <laughs> I like being pregnant. I really do. I loved being pregnant with Gemma. I liked most of this pregnancy, but it's just gotten to the point where I will not miss this thing anymore. It's too big, too heavy. I've done my job. Actually, Carrie, the one thing that I will miss is that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I think that's a sign. That is a sign that it's, it's not over. working out anymore. It's over. <laughs> it's Let's over. extract the treasure from this thing. 
This is like a treasure chest. Inside <laughs> is the most beautiful treasure you've ever seen. So we got inspired by your question of the nursery tour. And a couple days ago, we went and bought ribs and mattresses. We bought a shelf. We're gonna set up the dresser and we will actually have a nursery. So guys, the nursery tour coming soon. Gemma's big girl room tour coming soon. Pia's tour of <laughs> Pia's house tour. Her house coming soon. <laughs> Triplets. Coming soon. <laughs> like, how soon? Couple days. And thank you for all of your name suggestions. We actually are using one that we found in the comments. He said it out loud and I said, oh, I actually really like that. That's what we're using. We're using it. YouTube has actually named, named one, of our babies. one of our kids. We love you guys. You guys are actually a part of like family now. Pretty much you named our kids. <laughs> you should move in. I'm just saying. We'll take you all. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do. We love all of you guys that already are part of the chat fam. I'm gonna do my absolute best to give you guys a good birthing vlog, a birthing video. I might drop the camera. <laughs> I don't know. Can I even have a camera there? I have no idea. I'll sneak one. Give this video a thumbs up. We love you guys. And as always, XO. Love you.